Hello, beautiful ones. It's Victoria Laurent Fabish, and I wanted to come at you on a really relaxed Friday afternoon. I often take Fridays off, and I'm doing some work at home, but I wanted to talk about what are the commodities that you have on offer in your life. So often the commodities that are on offer are things like self-doubt, self-loathing, self-criticism. That's what you learn from the family of origin and the family of origin normalize that. The family culture generationally, you know, this is how we do it. This is how we do our, um, our, our communicating, our loving, our relationshiping. And we work with the commodities on offer. And usually those commodities on offer, um, especially if people have had, you know, years of, depression, anxiety, um, a lot of embitterment. These are, these are the sort of the results of the symptoms and the symptoms are the commodities of self-doubt, self-loathing, self-criticism, uh, you know, not, and, and I really want people to realize that you can change that just because it was normal, just because it was what you learned, just because, but because you saw that doesn't mean that you actually have to live that and you can change the commodities that you have on offer you can bring in other kinds of commodities like self-compassion unconditional self-love and experience a sense of 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 self believing in self and you can change that because you say hey i've got an awareness that this is what i learned from my family and then they learned it from their forefathers and, and it's passed down multi-generationally so what I what I what I want people to to understand is that awareness alone can do nothing. You know, awareness is great, but it's really just intellectual understanding of things. The journey from the head to the heart is the longest road, and you really want to take that road because it is the, it is the road that will lead you to being able to change that which you have normalized, that which you have metabolized from the family of origin, that which you have basically made uh, part of your essence, part of your being, part of your way of negotiating your relationships. So change the commodities on offer. What are your commodities on offer? You know, is it jealousy? Is it insecurity? Is it we're not allowed to celebrate ourselves? We're not allowed to uh, to embrace our our being. We're not allowed to shine. We're not allowed to think big. We're not allowed that if those are the commodities, I, I'm I'm promising you, you're gonna end up in a therapy office like mine, where you're like, I don't like my life. I don't like me. I'm I'm afraid to draw boundaries. I'm afraid to say no. All of that becomes normalized. All of that becomes a way of life. Then you feel passed over for promotions and you feel like you're not respected and people don't don't see you. They they treat you as invisible. No, change the commodities on offer. Bring new commodities and bring in self-value, self-worth, self-love, self-compassion, uh, you know, self-advocacy, uh, boundaries. Uh, all of these things are part of the journey. You know, develop routines that are that are really healthy that you don't give up for anybody. You know, develop routines that are that are about your hobbies, your likes, your wants, your needs, and that you don't that you don't give up for anybody, no matter what relationship you get into. And I uh, just wanted to show some of my beautiful, my beautiful, <laughs> my lovely orchids. They're my babies. Um, and also, I mean, I just I was writing a, a blog and I got inspired, 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 inspired to, to just do this IGTV video for you to realize that uh, I'm always thinking about you and I'm always thinking about ways to improve multi-generational experiencing so that the multi-generation, whatever's happening in this generation isn't passed on to the next generation if it's not healthy. You know, people have normalized toxic masculinity, have normalized toxic behavior, have normalized narcissistic behavior as ways, oh yeah, that's just the way my family does it. That's just the way I do it. That's just the way we do it. No, let's do something different. Let's just create awareness and then create action from that awareness. Have a beautiful uh, Friday and I hope you are able to change the commodities on offer. Be well.